Hi, this is a video for Jerry Norman. This is the Forest River Vibe 288 RLS. Jerry, I made a video earlier, it was too long, so I'm gonna kind of blast through it here. Uh, video wouldn't load on YouTube. So anyway, here's your 220 pound propane tanks. You can upgrade those to 30 if you want. Um, we've got uh, a tongue jack here that's electric. It's a lifesaver, it's got a light in it. If it battery's dead or or if it jammed or something, you can take this cap off and you got a manual crank there. Moving around to this front of the unit, side of the unit, has some storage. It goes up underneath, quite a bit of storage. There's a power inverter. Uh, this unit features two canopies, one on the unit itself and one on the slide-in. There's your out, external outdoor speakers. Um, this is cable and satellite connections. There's a power connection there. Okay, I know I'm moving fast, but YouTube wouldn't take the last video. I made it too long. I talked too much. So anyway, here's a here's the uh, spare tire on the back and that big window in the back that you uh, questioned. We talked about earlier on the telephone today. So okay, moving up this side of the unit. There's your 50 amp, 50 amp, not 30, 50 amp connection. Back black tank flush. That flushes the black water. Uh, you don't have to go in and flush the toilet like you used to in the old days. It's got an outdoor shower, it's a wand. Um, it does have hot features, hot and cold running water. Here's your fresh water connection, that's where you put your fresh tank. Um, this is also your six gallon water heater. It runs on propane, your city water connection, your heater intake and outtake vents. Let's go ahead and move into the inside. I'm sorry I'm moving so fast. Um, that last video I did was about 16 minutes long, so YouTube wouldn't take it. Uh, okay, so panning around just a little bit here. All right, this is a full electric Whirlpool residential style. I think it's eight cubic feet uh, refrigerator. It also features a, a stove with three burners. That's residential, has 10,000 BTU burner in the front, 27,500 uh, BTU burners in the back. It's got a hood vent that actually vents out to the outside. It's got a light and fan. There's 900 watt microwave oven. Okay, nice size microwave oven. Storage beside it and the stove does feature an oven. To the left of this is also a pantry. It's got a place to put your garbage can there. To the left of that is your entertainment center. has storage above it comes with a Furion AM FM radio that's Bluetooth. You can live stream or stream music to it from your phone. Uh, this is a electric fireplace. Once the, the heater, when the heater's on, it comes heat comes through the floor right there. But this will uh, you can turn that heat off and this will maintain the heat in the unit on cold days. Uh, here's the other side of that big window in the back. It's got that <coughs> couch there pulls out into a uh, queen size bed. Uh, a couple of lazy boys that I didn't straighten up uh, for the video uh, that face directly to the entertainment center because it's not good to watch TV with your head turned. It puts a crick in your neck. It's got storage up above it. You can see that. The unit's got plenty of storage. Here's a dinette set that breaks down into a bed as you well know. Um, the drawers are run the full length of the bench. Two big storage drawers. Right here on the side there's the uh, <coughs> fuse box. This is your uh, thermostat to control the house, your slide in, slide out. You can monitor your battery, fresh water, black water, gray water, tank levels right there. Uh, also the unit comes with a remote control to control all these things with a remote. In your center uh, console here in the kitchen it's got a residential style stainless steel um, faucet on it and also it's got storage underneath for your traditional things that you put, you know, under a, under a sink. There's your CO2 monitor to monitor CO2 gas. CO2 is heavier than air, so that's why it's down low. Uh, this unit features a dual entry bathroom, freestanding commode, really nice uh, shower. It's got a skylight on top. I'm six foot two. I don't have any problem getting in there. So as you can see, you have freestanding lavatory as well with storage and a medicine cabinet above that. Entering into the bedroom, we'll go to a queen size bed. Also have, um, we also have uh, your wardrobe storage right there, plenty of room for shoes, that sort of thing. And on each side you have a nightstand, so that makes it nice. So, entering back out 
into the main part. I'll pan through it one more time. Uh, hopefully this one will go through on YouTube. Uh, the unit does have the arch ceiling. It's got dual air conditioning of 15,000 and 13.5 BTU. That's about 2.4 uh, tons of air conditioning. And I did skip over here. We have some storage above the couch quite a bit. So anyway, moving right along. It uh, When you get here on Saturday, hopefully we'll get to go over it a little uh, slower. But anyway, this is the two... 88RLS. I think you'll really like it. Thanks for watching. Jim Gibbons, Cliff Jones, RV, Sealy, Texas, 281 802 0630.